Well, Kiao Nguyen is the founder and executive director of Burma Human Rights Network. That's a not-for-profit dedicated to reporting human rights violations. He joins us now from London. Thanks so much for speaking to us. Uh, first, if you can tell us what has been happening in Myanmar since the world's focus really, really shifted entirely to the pandemic. Have human rights abuses flown under the radar now in Myanmar? I mean, since the COVID-19 um, issue arise, the uh, Burmese military, they normally, the business as usual, they keep targeting the civilians in Rakhine City and other part of Burma. And the civil war is continued despite the UN Secretary General request to the globally to, to stop the uh, civil war. But, and, and also this is a hugely impact on COVID-19 control in, in across Burma because civilian, civil war is continuing and they're targeting the civilians and using air power and, and artilleries and shelling those uh, resident, uh, residential areas. So there are several, mount, the, the civilian casualties mounting up and they are not changing their, their course. So that's a very um, dangerous uh, situation coming up similar like 2017. Right. It is uh, a dangerous situation right now. And I mean, how much worse yeah. do you fear it could get? You know, if uh, fellow countries that would usually be leaders in tracking these kinds of abuses and organizations uh, won't be able to divert their resources and their attention to Myanmar. I mean, the, one of the sadly sad thing is, you know, even democratically elected government is praising to the military operation and the military personnel in Rakhine, those who are operating in, in, in Rakhine state. So that's really shocked us a few days ago. And there is a, there is a couple of uh, uh, incidents happening in, in that area that uh, we, which draw our attention as well, that one of the WHO driver has been hit and both sides denied the responsibilities. But one, is, one of the important thing we have to remind here is that Burma is under the International Criminal Justice Court, uh, Court of Justice uh, provision measure that saying that pre prevent the Burma to not committing any further, not escalate any further violence in the Rakhine state and protect the human life there. And they are clearly breaching this, this rule. Okay, Kelwin, we're going to have to leave it there. Thank you so much, though, for joining us yeah. from London. We appreciate it.